let us solve one problem on pipelining in this particular problem solve here the problem is there consider a four stage pipeline processor the number of cycles needed by four instructions i1 to i4 so here we are getting two instructions one is the uh, four stage pipeline and another one is the we are having four instructions we know that in case of pipeline architecture an instruction will get executed phase wise and each and every phase will have a cycle duration obviously this cycle duration will be same for all the phases and in case of pipeline execution instruction will be executed in parallel and phase wise interleaved we are having a separate video on this pipeline architecture you can watch it before observing this one this question came in the year 2009 get so now we are having this i1 i2 i3 i4 s1 s2 s3 s4 and these are the respective cycles per instruction per segment or phase so i1 for s1 segment 2 i1 for phase 2 1 i1 for phase 3 or segment 3 1 i1 for uh, segment 4 is 1 in this way we are having this four stage pipeline good so similarly for for other data uh, have been provided what is the number of cycles needed to execute the following loop one program segment has been given i shall have to tell that if i want to execute this program segment in this particular uh, given data then how much how much number of cycles it will take answers are given okay now what is the program for i is equal to 1 to 2 that means it is a loop which will go on executing twice and this these are the set of instructions within this loop body i1 then i2 then i3 then i4 and this loop will get executed twice how to solve such problems so in that case let me start with this one so i am writing s4 at the top s3 s2 and s1 so here we are having the cycles so one i don't know how far i should proceed let us have up to 24 let us have so now this is the these are the stages are there good i'm not drawing any line i'm just writing because in exam also you may not get enough time so i1 will be 2 1 1 1 so 2 so instruction number 1 instruction number 1 2 1 and then 1 1 then instruct, instruction number i2 will come 1 3 2 2 so 1 3 2 2 so it will come, come like this and there will be so many pipelines stall so many pipelines stall so let me do it again 2 1 1 1 so it will have 2 then 1 then 1 then 1 it will have 1 3 2 2 so after finishing this one then 1 then 3 then i shall uh, for 3 1 then 2 and then 2 in this way it will go okay next okay next time i shall not write one i shall write the uh, respective instruction number i think it will be let let me do it here also so 2 2 2 so that you can feel that i am executing instruction number 2 that will be better okay next one 3 so 2 1 1 3 so 2 1 1 and then 3 then i shall go for 4 so 1 2 2 2 so 1 2 2 2 in this way it will get executed so one loop has got completed i'm going for the second loop let me let me try again i shall come back to one again i shall come back to one so instruction number one two one 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 so instruction one one will be coming again so two then one then one then one okay then i shall go for instruction number two one three two two so one three two two next one two one one three next one two one one three so two one one three two one one three 
okay the last one the i4 i4 will be coming with 1 2 2 2 so 1 2 2 2 so so many pipeline stall has occurred and different phases and different cycles rather so now it is getting done so i am having this 23 it should be the answer so 23 should be the answer because it is requiring 23 cycles to complete this particular process complete this particular program segment so 23 yes 23 i am getting one answer here so that should be the answer so if such questions come just in the rough work you should have to do it because so many pipeline stalls will be coming so only just adding and manipulating using formula might not give you the correct result because other results are very close so you cannot guess you can the, your guess work will not work so in this way we are getting this so now you see if here we are allowing loop wise parallelism that means the first loop got completed at 15th step so another loop has got started so i have got I have, judging this one as a loop loop wise parallelism otherwise what will happen it will take 15 and then again it will start from here and it will take 15 so in that case it will take 30 fortunately i am not getting 30 options so that's why i'll be ticking with the 23 so in this way you can solve such problems uh, please practice such problems more thanks for watching this video